<laughs> that have strange properties and change all the rules. And that's just the way it is in physics. We discover the universe is stranger than we thought it was and the rules change. And some people don't like that. They say, no, no, you're not allowed to change the rules. But actually, discovering the rules are different is what we call learning. It's something theologians don't know about. It's called mm. learning. And, and, and theology has never learned anything. In, 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 it, it, there's no contribution to knowledge in, in, in the knowledge base of humanity from theology in the last 500 years. And I say that not, not in a biased sense. I've asked theologians. I've been, I've been with theologians. And I, and I challenge them. I say, give me one contribution to knowledge that theology has made since the scientific revolution in the last 500 years. And they all say the same thing. What do you mean by knowledge? And, and, I, and I, I would submit that if you asked a physicist or a chemist or a biologist or a psychologist or uh, right. uh, what contributions to knowledge they made, their fields have made, they wouldn't say, what do you mean by knowledge? They'd give you an example. And I think they're driven to that because they don't have examples. And, and um, that's, uh, that's, uh, that's really important. The fact that religion has all the answers before you even ask the questions means you can't possibly add to knowledge because they don't, you know, the answer is always God did it. And that's not an answer to knowledge. It's interesting too. Like I recently interviewed, um, well, let me mention this. Do you know Tim Mention? Yeah, he's, he's a friend of mine. Yeah, I know Tim. Did you interview Tim? No, not no. yet. I'd uh, love uh, to. I plan he's a, on he's trying. He's a guy. Yeah. He's hilarious. I'm going to have him on my podcast. So there you go. Anyway. <laughs> well, you'll probably beat me to the punch. So uh, okay. no, but I'd, I'd love to definitely interview him. I loved his uh, thank you God uh, video. Yeah, <laughs> and he's yeah. talking about the mom who's, uh, she had cataracts. And yeah. he's like, it couldn't be misdiagnosis. It couldn't be yeah. all yeah. these other things. I thought he's that brilliant. was, man, that he really he's is. Brilliant. He's brilliant. He's great. Tim mentioned, I'm a huge fan of his and, and I'm fortunate to know him. Yeah. That's awesome. So. 